etc. Any part of the body susceptible to pain becomes the playground of the so-called tear gas. This is a key difference from other gaseous compounds such as sarin gas, which causes muscle paralysis and asphyxiation, very different and much more lethal effects. While substances like sarin are designed to kill, tear gas is meant to cause prolonged pain without being lethal. Tear agents can be categorized by the pain receptors they activate. The first category includes substances that act on TRPA-1 receptors, such as CS gas, the most commonly used compound by U.S. security forces due to its rapid action. The first symptoms of irritation appear within 20 seconds of exposure and can last up to 30 minutes or more, even after moving away from the affected area. 